stars. Elsa was reciting a poem about stars. She looked at the picture of stars in her book and wondered about them. What are stars? How many stars are there in the sky? Elsa asked her elder brother Peter. Stars are huge balls of hot gases, mostly hydrogen and helium. There are billions of stars in the universe, replied Peter. How are stars formed? asked Elsa. Stars are formed from giant clouds of helium and hydrogen. When the gases are clumped together, they develop gravity. As gravity increases, dense clouds are formed. They turn into flattened disks, which eventually become stars, said Peter. Then why do they appear so tiny? asked Elsa. They look so small because they are very far away from the earth. In fact, the sun is also a star. But it appears so big because it is closer to the earth. Peter explained, showing her a poster. Does that mean the small twinkling stars that we see in the sky might be even bigger than the sun? Elsa asked, looking at the starry sky from her garden. Yes, some stars are bigger than the sun. But there are also other stars which are smaller. Peter replied. In fact, scientists have discovered that stars differ in color, depending on how hot they are. A star can be blue, green, white, yellow, orange, red or brown. The hottest stars are blue, Peter added. Then why do they all look white? questioned Elsa. That is because they are very far away. So, our eyes cannot see their actual color, Peter explained patiently. Do stars remain in the universe forever? asked Elsa. No, when the gases that form a star cool down, the star disappears. Also, new stars are being formed all the time. Do you know what a group of stars set in a recognizable pattern is called? asked Peter showing her a chart. Yes, it is called a constellation, said Elsa. That's right, Elsa, smiled Peter. Why do stars twinkle? asked Elsa. Stars do not twinkle. When their light enters the earth, the disturbance in the atmosphere makes them look like they are twinkling, Peter explained. Oh, and what are shooting stars? asked Elsa. Shooting stars are actually small pieces of rocks which burn up on entering the Earth's atmosphere. These rocks are known as meteors, replied Peter. Wow, this is so interesting. Now I know everything about stars, exclaimed Elsa. Not everything, Elsa. There is much more to explore when you grow up, said Peter. The End